I want to know your name, man. I want to know if you got a man. I want to know. Um. All right, guys. So my hair is already um, clean. I used the Bentonite Aztec Clay to cleanse my hair. And I have a video on that if you guys like to check it out. I will have it linked above with the iCard or down below in the description box. After I used that, um, I went in with the Maya Organics Bubble Soothing Deep Conditioner. So to just jump right into this tutorial, so I already wet my hair with some water and then I went in with the Shea Moisture Miracle Styler Leave-In. I love this stuff. And so on my right side, I'm going to use this Curling Souffle by Shea Moisture. And on the left side, I'm going to use their Anti-Frizz Max Hold Gel. And this is my first time ever, 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 ever seeing this gel. And I got this gel about a week ago. But this is the first time ever seeing it. I did not know Shea Moisture had this gel. Now I've used the curling. Come on. Now I've used the um, curling souffle before. Like um, a few years ago, I've used this souffle like three years ago, I believe. One thing I didn't like about the souffle was that it, it left my hair feeling really, really sticky in my neck. So they smell the same, the exact same. I mean, they are a part of the same line. So, so we're just gonna jump right in. I'm gonna start off with the um, the holding gel side, only because I've never used it before. So, like I said, I already went in with some water. Just gonna add some more water, and then some leave-in. Now my hair is so soft. Like mix with the um, Aztec clay and then using that deep conditioner, A1. My hair is so soft. All right, I'm gonna start off with a little bit of the gel. Um, it's not like the consistency of, of any eco styler I've ever had or What's that gel called? That wet line extreme gel? Doesn't feel like that either. It's kind of thin. It's a really thin hold, but not a hold, but it's a really thin consistency. But it says um, max hold, so if this is the max, that means I can't go no higher than this if it don't hold my hair, huh? I really try not to use too much because it's kind of hard it's kind of like caramel but a watered down caramel that's like i don't know if y'all can see that or not it's like it doesn't feel like gel so with this um holding gel it says that it has silk protein in it so that's good. That could be why it's so um, soft like. And it's really cool. I have to show you guys. It has a flip top. Like, I don't think I've seen that yet on products. So like, it has this cute little flip top. I like it. I think it's really convenient.
this side. This side was the Max Hold Gel. And to be honest, right off the back, it doesn't feel like nothing Max Hold about it. Um, it makes you just want to keep adding more and keep adding more because it's so thin. All right, so with the curling souffle, it's kind of like a, a jelly. Um, I'm not sure if it's supposed to be like this or not, or because I remember it back in the day, it was it wasn't as thick, but this is like really thick, like nothing is coming out of here. Wow, wasn't expecting that. All right, so it's coming out in like little chunky pieces. So I'm just gonna smush it together in my hand. Ew. I hope these chunky pieces don't get stuck in my hair. they both seem to give off a nice shine I think my souffle kind of froze maybe I think that's why it's like this it, it kind of settled I don't recall like at all because if this is how it is then it shouldn't be because it's like gel you know how jello is it's like jello pieces and I have to squish them together like that's too much work so I'm gonna just say Mine froze because my hair, my house was cold. That's what we're gonna say. Cause like I said, I don't recall it being like this formula. So the souffle does have more slip than the gel. Alright, so now I, I finally finished and so remember this side is the souffle side and this side is the um, holding gel. So I'm going to sit underneath my hooded dryer and I'll be back either tonight or tomorrow morning. We'll see how long it takes my hair to dry. <laughs> All right, y'all, so my hair is dry. I sat under the dryer and I diffused my hair. And I'm sad because, so this side with the souffle, it's soft, but it's still like sticky and greasy. And this side is just like hard and dry. I'm mad because my hair was like really soft and really nice before I put this on and now I gotta wash all this out. This is the part I hate about being a YouTuber. Like, when things turn out not as planned. So, I'm definitely gonna wash this out because this side is sticky and I like the curl pattern on this side. I'm not too feeling the curl pattern on this side. This one's more stiff. This one's like full of body. So, I didn't feel like getting cute about this. And then this side, the souffle messed up my shirt. Hopefully it washes out. So yeah, like I said, like I was saying, I don't feel like getting cute, put on a makeup or nothing because I gotta wash this out because I gotta go to school tomorrow. So yeah. So hope you guys like coming. Oh, hold on, before I let y'all go. So this side, which was the gel side, when I, it didn't pair well with that leave-in that I used, the, um, silicone miracle even it didn't pair well at all it left some white residue in my hair but yeah that's all i had to say about that so i'm gonna let y'all go and i will see you guys in my next video please make sure you like comment and subscribe and happy valentine's day well late valentine's day at this point